Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of uh, Empire Total War. So, the Danes have declared war on us. That's... That's very annoying. I think the best course of action will be to try and request peace. Of course they don't take that. Uh, what if we give you Karelia? What if we... Karelia and Estonia. Cool. So, we just lost a lot of land. Granted. But here's my reasons for it. First of all, the Danes generally have a bigger navy. We'll work on our navy while we're at it. On top of that, these two regions, they are not that useful. And lastly, sure, Russia may, might win, but or uh, sure, Denmark gets two territories. Uh, two, I think it was. But we know something the Russians don't, or the Danes don't. The Russians have a lot more territory. So we can just have these guys recover, we'll have them attack Achengels, we'll have these guys as soon as they're fully ready, we'll go uh, on Moscow. These guys will just keep on building up. And then we'll get a lot more land. Then uh, we lost to the Danes. And using that gained power, we declare war on the Danes again, to reconquer our lost territories. And then some. That's the plan. Now to execute it. I'm gonna try, that's for sure. And that counts for something. I hope. If it doesn't, well, that's a, that, that, that's gonna be... Problem for later, I guess. Haha, ha, ha, Denmark, but we recently uh, made peace. Hopefully, they don't. If they immediately declare war on me, I'm fucked. Apologies for that, that was me, so uh, don't check your notification, guys. In Empire Total War, okay. buildings are spread throughout the region. Uh, diplomatic relations. Why did that cancel? Okay, what about 13 colonies? Excellent. Oh, we lost the general. Where? This guy? I guess we're getting a new general. Build a second rate there as well. Second rate, I mean fifth rate. This army is still recovering. That army is still building. And the turn. Let's see what the Danish does do. Hopefully they do nothing so I can focus on my uh, Russian war. Ooh, the Dutch are not having a pretty time with the Spanish. Ooh, and that's a significant army. But I'm not too worried. Soon we'll have an even more significant army. Because it'll be propped to the top with line infantry.
useful natural resources okay. are present in most regions. Nice canister shot. That means we can do trade. this. Building and improving There we go. Another fifth raid. These guys will go here. Let's upgrade you as well. Let's sell you there. Mm, we can't really afford more than two armies right now. So let's work on building two armies. Okay, that's a long march. Well, I mean, we can start that march. Try to capture Archangelsk. Danish fleet is also slow. Oh, their fleet is scary. Am I happy I'm not at war with them because they'd blockade me uh, and probably uh, do a lot of damage on my war effort? There is a port in this region that has not yet been developed. Select the time okay, well, uh, construct here. The fishing port will help your population that. grow. A trade port will provide an income from overseas. Let's uh, do another fifth raid. Just uh, keep them coming. Line infantry it does have some line infantry. Let's take a look what's in Moscow. This panel shows you the information about an agent working for your nation. His name. Okay. Let's go attack him. We have uh, less cavalry. They have some militia. Let's fight this out. Find out what kind of la terrain we're talking about. Okay. We'll place our cannon up here. Uh, you guys. On the right flank in a bit of a V-ish formation. You guys on the left flank. Similar deal. We'll pop a cavalry on the right. General behind. The enemy are holding their ground. Waiting. Uh sure that the general's bodyguard. We Okay, that's not a great hit, but... Let's have our cavalry charge into their cavalry. 
Let's have one cavalry f hit them in the rear though. Come on, get the general. Wavering. Broken. Okay, I just want to... In the end, my main focus is just breaking them. Killing as many as possible, of course, is a nice bonus. Yeah, I keep on firing at their uh, bodyguard. Hopefully we'll get lucky. I need to maneuver a bit cl carefully so that I don't hit any of those barricades. Are those melee? Come to charge. Perfect, perfectly done. Let's load the canister in our in our cannons. Only problem with plague bayonets is that you can't do anything else with the infantry after you've done it. They're stuck in melee mode. Okay, cool, cool, cool.
we're definitely working them over. Oh, these guys went into melee. Uh, they're doing... They're doing quite a bit of damage, so let's go for it. Let's have our cannon cease fire. Come on. Stay strong, cavalry. You're twice their numbers. Like something broken. Now for the other unit. Broken. Can we shatter them? Yes. They're wavering. Plug bayonets are a lot better than no bayonets. Let's have our cannon cease fire. Although I doubt they'll make it in time, they can try. And you guys can join since you're also melee mode. Glorious. Absolutely glorious. Aye. Priorities. It's going there. Not fast, but it's going. Taken a lot of casualties with all this melee fighting. Of course, the Russians are also taking a lot of casualties. That's loud. I'm going deaf. They're all very low. 
definitely have no choice but to recover, recover uh, replenish my forces after this battle. Hello everybody and welcome to another episode. Ah, we're finished. Uh, let's end the battle. Uh, I said another episode. Um, welcome back. Sorry I got interrupted. But uh, we're back now. So, uh, yeah, oof. Heavy losses. Manar Pramot. Let's march you back. Halt! Let's start replenishing one unit. Okay. Uh. Yeah. Let's end the turn. That's one downside of uh, Empire Total War, the enters are rather, rather long. You know what might help? Nah, we're not gonna do that because... I was thinking maybe disable the following the AI, but it's useful information to have, you know? Okay, cool. Cool. Killer chance. Uh, still not enough units uh, or money. Next turn we will have enough to uh, finish our replenishment, and then we can mo march on Mos Moscow. The, the, this Danish navy is scary though. So let's see, how big is Russia? Rather big. So this will go boop, 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 I guess. And it's a pity the territories we lost to the Danish in the peace deal. As long as they're happy. Soon we'll march on Moscow. And then we'll be happy. You have a long way to go. I'm curious what will happen in Central Europe. Hmm? 
Okay. That's a Russian, small Russian army, if you want to call it an army. It's more like a small unit. Cool, cool, cool. Um, speaking of research, let's uh, continue down that path. We want to get to five by rank ASAP. On the march to Achengelsk. There we go. And another line infantry on recruitment. It's gonna take a while before we can uh, continue on an offensive. That battle was a very uh, hurtful battle. We sure crippled them, but we got crippled in return. And eventually we'll also declare a war on the Ottomans. Because uh, they're annoying in this game. They deserve to be removed. But hey, get, uh, capturing uh, Russia gives us a border with the Ottomans. I wouldn't mind it either if uh, the uh, Ottomans declared war on Russia, or Russia declared war on the Ottomans. Something they'd eventually do anyways. Reveals new cutting edge technology. I know. Uh, I don't have enough money to get two of them. Oh, I do. I do. I do. Oof, the income is sad. decreasing though. Let's see. Let's take you free. You can go back. And let's march on uh, Moscow. Oh, excellent. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Bankruptcy. Not cool. Uh, yeah, sure. Hopefully next turn we'll capture our Chengels, which will put us in the black again. We're gonna capture our Chengels, and then we're gonna end the episode. That's what we're gonna do.
having troops out and about costs more uh, in terms of money compared to having them in cities as well or your own territory so uh, capturing archangels will make uh, our monetary load a lot lighter Well, I won't say a lot lighter, a bit lighter. Ah, Russian army approaches. Oh, we could use this to our advantage. We can storm... Uh, just storm past and go for Moscow. Your nation could be making more money through trade. Instigate diplomacy to make new trade agreements. The diplomatic negotiation. Demand surrender. Surrender refused. Okay, we're gonna do that in the ep next episode then. So I do hope you all enjoyed. Be sure to leave a like, subscribe, and all of that. And uh, I'll see you next time. Bye.